Kelly, how are you? Welcome back to my channel where today I thought I would just pick up the camera and film some general post lockdown life, day in the life. Um, today's Monday the 2nd of August and I have a few things to do today because I didn't get much done last week and I thought I would just share bits and pieces with you. So Wednesday we were officially out of lockdown and my day kind of went normal. I uh, had Zumba that morning, my son went to school, picked him up, came home, just did bits and pieces and yeah that was fine. Thursday um, I didn't have any Zumba as normal because of restrictions so I kind of was there like, what do I do? And I had planned to clean and do other stuff and I just got distracted with bits and pieces as it is when you're home and I did do some things I didn't film um, and I baked a few little things here and there so mm, yep and then Friday my son went to school and I kind of remember what I did I think I went into like two shops on the way home and that was it um, Friday afternoon though went to Kmart because we <laughs> we were looking for that kettle and toaster and then I put the haul up so that took me ages to edit that so but that was really good and of course still don't have a kettle or a toaster we're boiling our water on the stove and then we had plans on the weekend to go look for a coffee machine well Saturday it just poured all day and my still, son still had his social group, that was good, but also, yeah, due to restrictions, couldn't do Zumba either. So, uh, I've just kind of like, what day is it? Where am I? Because everything's just out of whack. I kind of like want it all or nothing. I don't want bits here and there. Um, and then Sunday, oh, we just, it was Sunday. <laughs> we were just home. And I was just like, I'm not going to the shops today, so we chilled. So today is Monday and it's literally nearly lunchtime and I'm still in my pyjamas because I've edited a whole lot of stuff this morning for YouTube and did some emails and did some other work. I need to get some Zumba things organised. I have Zumba tonight, which is exciting, uh, but again restricted, so I've only got a very small group of people, but that's okay. And then Tuesday my classes are back as normal and then Wednesday classes are back as normal and then Thursday onwards should be all normal. Yes. Oh my gosh, yeah. So um I need to get some lunch. I need to get this kitchen clean because the weekend with the weather it was, you know when it's just raining so much you just ugh, you get up and go, it went. Um, I have at least defrosted um, some mints and some pasta you would have seen in my food hacks. I pre-packaged some pasta sheets. I've got that ready to make a lasagna because tomorrow night I have a governing council meeting at school. So I also need to bake a treat to take to them and then make the lasagna tonight so we have it for leftovers for tomorrow night because I'll be gone a bit earlier so everyone can just reheat dinner. And I need to rebake some cookies and clean the kitchen and whatever else I come. I was planning on redoing some of my bedroom and the clothes that I have in there, and I still have to finish the bathroom. Uh, so they'll just go on the list for next time. This is why I just I can't meal plan, I can't schedule, I can't organise anything. I literally wake up and I um <laughs> I do what I feel like that day. So yes, everything's always all over the place so um, I'm gonna get some lunch then I'm gonna get dressed cuz you know <laughs> um, and then we'll see where we end up
this is all over TikTok. People say once a load is finished, you put the tea towel in part way and close the door and it will catch all the steam and stop the water pooling on top of the dishes. I find it doesn't actually work, so I threw the tea towel directly on the top tray and I'll show you later what it looks like. So the brownies are cooked and now I'll stick the cookies in there and they will disappear just as fast as what they came out. I moved on to washing the next load of dishes, drying and putting away the first lot and then washing the next lot. I could have emptied the dishwasher and then reloaded it and run another wash but I figured I was already here, I'm happy to hand wash. It's amazing how many dishes we accumulate in one weekend even though we're quite minimal with some of the things that we have. They pile up really quickly when nobody... having to clean up the lovely mess that is left there <laughs> oh well this is what being a baker is all about the messes <laughs> thank you so much for watching everybody i hope that you enjoyed joining me for this day in the life of being home and i hope that all to my friends in new south wales and victoria in lockdown you're safe and i'm thinking of you please like comment and subscribe to the channel and i look forward to seeing you next time bye